Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. In the last episode, we started all the way through Sky Keep, and after rearranging some rooms, we got through the forest room, and we fought the first piece of the trial force, but we needed a key to get it, so we now rearranged rooms a little bit more, and now we're in the room number five, the factory room. So let's make our way through the factory room now to continue on our quest. So yeah, this, this is going to be a little interesting because this is one, this is one of those rooms you have to do real do a lot of uh, time shift up. We have to do we have to do a lot of uh, we have to do a lot of uh, time shift carrying. And, so that's going to do a lot of a lot of the time shift stones. So we're going to have to be very prepared for that. And we got another elemental skull and a gold one. So yay! All right. So now we just continue through here, and now that we have the time shift stone, we can go through here because we couldn't go through here at first because the stupid uh. Alright, so now here we got to defeat one of these stupid things. So now we just got to... It's really not hard, it's just a little pain in the ass. And now that we got to... Basically remember those little bitty things, we got to... Just pay attention to what... Uh, Alright, so there we go, and we get... A nice little rupee out of it. Now, set this thing right there, just right in front of the iron bars. We're, we're, we're going to the north for just a second. And now, if you notice here, there's a switch. Which now opens up those iron bars. We gotta put it there so we can get to that switch, otherwise, it would be out of uh, time. All right, so now, toss that. And now we just need to head back up here and continue on our way. Now that we've got the time shift stone up here to the second floor with us. Push that switch and now we got Everything in our way. Alright. Now we gotta go down here. Got another techno moblin. Boom! Bitch. And another Techno Moblin who is not even paying attention to us. Alright. Alright, so now, lower corner of the chamber, we need to leave that right there for just a minute. Looking for an arrow switch. May I, I may have it in the wrong spot. Maybe on this other side that we need it at, right here. Oh, yeah, they see that we need that arrow switch activated. So all we gotta do now is do that and go. Boom! Which will open up those iron bars. Yeah. 
now that we got that out of the way, yeah, this is a little bit of work. We need to go on this little wet vein platform. Alright, so now we're just going. As far as we can go. And now that we got those, we can go. Oh yeah. All right. So now that we got here, we just go. So you get him to the other side. But there ain't nothing to it. Yeah. The, uh, the whole objective is to uh, get this time shift stone. That's all we really need. And now we're in this area, which is full of stuff. And basically the same thing. Throw it on there. Now it's just a shortcut back to the beginning if you need a shortcut. Careful, we're going to be very quick with this now. Now, if you notice, we got this. But, also, since we didn't get all, there's, if you notice, there's five little, and my stupid Wiimote's messing up again. There. But now with that little thing, it starts switching the, uh... You have to hit all five of these switches really quick. I'm away. I'm gonna get all five of those switches hit. It opens up that switch. And we no longer need any of this stuff. It opens up another control panel though. We need it in a room two, which is this one? I think it's this one. And we'll all, but we'll have to get to room two, possibly through room one. So. So room two is... Hmm. 
is... Yeah, it's this one. And right now we are right there. I was never good at these slide, these little sliding puzzles anyway. It just makes it a little bit, this just makes it even more annoying. There we go. So basically what we gotta do here is go all the way back around, go all the way back through. We'll save real quick and then go back to the pre room the previous room and then do that previous room with room six. It should get us through to, to room two. Which will be the next room we need to deal with anyway, which is the Earth Room. Yay! So now, that was just through here. And now, and here should be a new room. It should be the Earth Room. The Earth Temple Room, basically. Yep. All right, so we can't go through there because it's barred by gate. And we can't go through there because it's also barred by gate. So what are we supposed to do? Well, first things first, we gotta find a way to open up these gates. Yay. Alright, so now that we're in here, there's this one little lonely bomb in here. What we gotta do is roll it in there to okay. so blow up those rocks on the other side so we can get through. Hey! So now that we got those rocks out of the way, we can go here to the other side. Don't you just love it? What? Oh my god, that's a... Alright. Now if you notice here, there's a little place we can burrow into. Yep, now we get to do more burrowing. Now we got that out of the way. You can switch, switch, and boom. Now we got that red gate out of the way. Now that we got that out of the way, we can go a little bit further in now. And the dogs are once again fighting behind me. These dogs never learn. And once again, my stupid controller. I hate this sometimes. There. Now 
Anyway, now that we got that red gate blocked out of the way, we should be able to get a little bit further in now. And uh, now we got a uh, Dark Lizalfos. Shouldn't be anything to it though. Yep, nothing to it. And a lizard tail. And okay. Now, we need some bombs. Oh, we were already on the bombs. Let's throw it in that little basket right there. <laughs> Boom! But we're not going to activate that statue quite yet. Now we're just going to uh, roll this down and go wee. All right, it's going to be a little tricky, but we got this. There. No. There we go. Whew. It takes a few tries, but. Now that we're in this room, now we just enter this room where the switch is at. And you notice there might be nothing in here, but if you look closely, there's some vines. You go, wah, 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 wah. climbing, 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 climbing. Stand at the very edge of this without falling off. If you notice very closely in there, there's a bomb. Alright, how are we going to get to that bomb though? Just like that. And now that we have everything we need, we can go. Oh, let's just do this a little bit better just to make sure we have it all. One more time. This should be good enough, hopefully. No, I'm going to need to get those a little bit better. I need to make sure it's a complete horizontal strike. Like that. Alright. Now that we got them all out of the way. Now that we got them all out of the way without hitting the freaking tree. Without hitting the freaking tree. Should be able to go right up in here and go. Boom. All right. Now that we have all three switches, we need a. There's a certain way we got to activate them, which is why I didn't activate all the switches yet. So the first thing we got to do is go back in here, activate this one first. We have to do it from lowest to highest. But the problem is, is how do you get up there? How do you get back to the one that's the uh, Easy enough, just go. Not like that. Ah, okay. 
Yo soy peor. And then let's go one. Two. And then we'll rub the we go up the sandy slope. Be careful. Don't hit that one. We've already hit that one. Actually, the last one we can just go. Back down and around. We'll just go back that one and around. And, uh, use the hook beetle to hit. To hit. Just like that. And if everything goes right, we'll go. It should open up. Yep, the arm bars. That we, that we saw earlier that we couldn't get through, but now we can. And of course, Link burns his butt. So now that we got, we can go through here, we should be able to go all the way around. And no. Where's those iron bars at? Oh, right here. So now that we got that, we can now enter this burrow and we're on the other side. And let's go. We hit that bomb. Hurry up. Hit the bomb again. Quickly move back. ones. You have to go this way. So hurry up and go. Wee. There we go. Just a quick way out if you needed it. And now that we've got all that, we can now go over here and the blue switch and let's put that red gate back in its original position. Now that uh, we got that out of the way, we can just go. We oh yeah, we gotta go back. We have to make this the long way around, of course. Maybe. Because we're supposed to be back, go back into the uh, the uh, hole we were in, way back in there. Let's just go back in this hole and see what happens. I, I need to go try to go back in that hole is the problem. It should open up a new path. Oh, it does. It's over here. Nothing really interesting in there, but here's another burrow. All right, so now in here, yay! We have to defeat the two centipedes. This is not an option. We have to defeat these two. So, so. but you know what to do with these by now. You've done them enough times. They're not hard, they're just a little tedious. Uh, 
I mean, they're not honestly, they're not hard, they're just tedious. And there we go, there's one of them out of the way. Now to get to the other one, we have to break this boulder and get to the other side. But this one's going to be a little bit trickier because it's a lot smaller space. There's a lot smaller space, so you're gonna have to be really careful. But once you defeat it, then. Ow! Stop it! One more. Now we just got one more. Woo! Stop it! And now that we got him knocked out, there we go. Finally. Now we got him out of the way, we can finally get to the exit, which is up here. And it leads to another panel. But we're gonna end it here, guys. When we come back, we're gonna hit this panel and we're uh, going so we can get to room number seven, finally. And once we get to room number seven, we'll be able to get that small key and rearrange it to finally get the first piece of the trial force and move on and stuff like that. So we're getting closer and closer, guys. When we come back, we're going to rearrange it to get to room number seven, get the small key, and get the first piece of the trial force, hopefully. So have a good day. I'll see you all next time on Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. This is DKS3 of the Crazy Gamer, signing out.